In this video, I'm just going to show you how you can add a Swatches file to an application support folder in a user account. So instead of actually adding it to the usual presets account where you would need an admin password, you can actually just add it to your user account. This is on a Mac. Similar sort of thing can be done on a PC as well. And also, of course, with earlier versions of Illustrator. Now, first thing to do, and I'm just going to go over to my finder, is actually find the location. The key thing here is to actually go to the application support folder. Now, actually to get that, it might be a hidden folder on your system. So uh, you can go to go to go and go to folder and just then put that library. It's a little squiggle slash library. And then you can go to that. So you can go to it and then you can see application support, then Adobe. And you go down to Adobe Illustrator 18. That's pretty weird. I know it's uh, obviously it should be Adobe Illustrator CC, but that's uh, what it is, number 18. And then go all the way down. And I've actually added the file already to this folder. So it's swatches down here. So I've added the contour set from Graphic Extras, pack 51. Now, just going to go over to Illustrator. I'm using CC 2014. And there's one of the uh, designs. And there's the actual swatches. So if you go over to the swatches palette, if you can't see the swatches palette, it's window and swatches. Actually, also, you can just go down here, swatches, and you will see just there, swatches library, and user defined, and there you can see it again, contour swatches. Just select it from there. But again, do it from the swatches palette as well. On the right side, just go down there and open the swatch library. Just go down to user defined, and there you can find it there. Also, of course, you can, if you don't actually put it into that folder or into the presets, then you have to use the other but it's quite convenient just to use user defined and you can just find it there no admin passwords etc required hope you found this of interest